This week, we shift ground in several ways in our study of the political, legal, sociology of human rights. First, after much investigation of complex texts and legal rights, we move to the sociological level and the sociological analysis of human rights. Second, what this means is examining up close the connection between human rights as lived and the cultural values as well as the institutional arrangements that support these rights. Third, we will take a very hard look and critical examination of the role of elites in the management of human rights. That is, high status careers offered in human rights and the exercise of power as these support but sometimes undermine more local levels of grassroots movements or human rights. Thus, we finally begin to connect these institutional power arrangements to grassroots movements that emerge through local leadership on the ground. We begin with Kate Nash's the Political Sociology of Human Rights, chapters one to four, in which she begins with two main challenges. That is, first, avoiding a kind of Eurocentric or Eurocentrism in terms of our view of human rights. And then second, taking a close look, examining both the structures, the institutional structures, the social structures, and the cultural meanings attached to these. And then second, the, the grassroots approach or the bottom up based on movements for human rights on the ground. Our key question following Kate Nash has to do with the social construction of human rights. What are human rights? What is the role of culture? What is the role of structure? What role do organizations play? What role do states play? And what role does the United Nations play? Finally, in addition to the assigned reading material, I have added to the site a recent article uh, authored by me and by Stephanie Paris, a recent graduate of the program. That article is forthcoming and it will give you a sense of the kind of work that I personally have been doing really in the analysis of human rights. Additionally, I have added both a New York Times article on Saudi Arabian women and then a short video on Saudi Arabian women. So I very much look forward to uh, our interaction over the next four weeks. Remember, we're now on the downhill slope and we will be finishing up very quickly both your research proposals, your visit to an NGO, and the discussion as we read about the social construction of human rights.